Terrorhawk, stay on this channel. This is an emergency. Do you remember when we first met? I do, yes. It was uh, it was at Brit Sci-Fi in Leicester at the National Space Centre. Yes. And we had uh, we had dinner together, and we uh, I think we bonded over a gin and tonic. I think. Is that what it was? Yeah. <laughs> well, it's because we, we were. I was going to say we we're up north, but Leicester isn't really the north. But uh, everybody had ordered beer, and we, we were the only people to order uh, gin and yeah, tonics. Because yeah. uh, I arrived when you were all having dinner, didn't yeah. I? In a sort of flustered, slightly camp way. <laughs> and then ordered a gin and tonic. Huh. So we were talking about things that we could do and... Uh, that weren't and owned by ITV. Exactly. Yeah. Jerry Anderson properties that weren't owned by ITV or others. And I'd recently been talking to Christopher Burr about Terrorhawks, because I bloody love Terrorhawks. And I said, how about we do Terrorhawks? And you said... I'll need to be convinced it's a job for Terrorhawks. <laughs> that was almost your exact your, response. What's your version of what I said? What? I won't tell you my version. Uh, it's unprintable. I think. I think you said, uh, yeah, all right. I don't. I don't really remember Terror Hawks, but yeah, why not? Yeah. Something like that. So you know, yeah. really committed to it in a really strong and uh, helpful well, way. Well, I wanted to do a, a Jerry Anderson thing, and uh, and I and we had talked about potential projects before it wasn't just socializing no. so we talked about well, how could we work together and yeah and i thought well yeah, i can see that that's got a following and we could and and you owned it as it well, well you didn't own it because we're in control, of it. In control yeah. of it so that's right and uh yeah so i thought yes it's yes it's i'm not the right generation for terror hawks so i wasn't going to too fake young. any yeah, yeah, too, too far too young <laughs> no way lad you better get your circuits tested um but yeah, I could see that it would be something worth doing and fun to work on. Yes, sir. That's half the battle with doing any new things for Big Finish, is finding people with the right skills base who can take the project from beginning to end. And, and I could see in Jamie the potential to do that, really. You know, I know, it's crazy, isn't Thanks. it? Why no, do you no. think that? Because, you, you I... know, I did, I did say to you at one point, well, what have you got? And you said, well, I've got my father's jeans. And you held them up. That's a little joke. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> For space sake. I think, actually, Terrorhawks is really accessible uh, because it's not, you know, it's not hard sci-fi. Uh, there's nothing really kind of so peculiar about it that it would exclude anybody. Um, there's just the right amount of humour in it with a kind of sci-fi twist. So it, it's it's really enjoyable whether you caught Terrorhawks the first time round, uh, don't know it, or even if actually there are, there's a big part of the the Jerry Anson fan base who's seen Terrorhawks before, uh, but were already fans of Thunderbirds or Space 1999 and one of those older shows, and so when it came out originally in '83, they weren't too enamoured with it uh, because it wasn't like the old stuff. But I would say just put that aside and and give it a go because. Uh, we've had a really talented bunch of writers on this. I don't mean me. I'm not being self-congratulatory at all. But the the other writers have done amazing scripts. We've had so many laughs in the studio, um, and you know the actors have uh, you read through their scripts already for the most part, Jeremy. <coughs> uh, and so you know they're prepared for the jokes, and yet they still laugh. There's been so much hilarity in the booths. I've laughed a lot when yeah. I've been in the control room. There yeah. you go. I really, I really think that you'll enjoy it uh, whether you're a fan of the original series or not so it's genuinely funny and genuinely exciting as well yeah. and it is marvelous that there's so few people doing the voices as was the case originally doing all the different voices and they're they're incredible they're great there's great warmth in the characters and the stories i think yeah yeah it's, it's all in a day's work lad i think if you're into the big finish audios generally i think it's worth worth a listen I, I just don't, you know, you're not going to be bored. You're going to be uh, amused. And, yeah, and I you think will be it, entertained. Yeah, you will be entertained. There will, there will be much wonderment. Yes. <laughs> Wonderful! There's, there's a lot of little bits and pieces like that where we are uh, lampooning current events and sort of uh, current celebrity and stuff. The, the uh, the well known boy band No Direction makes an appearance in one of the episodes, uh, and there's just silly little things like that 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 
are just so accessible in it that I think most people will really, really enjoy. All right, lads, have the double. I'm telling you, it's out in April 2015, which is a, a massive month for Jerry Anderson stuff in general. So it's uh, a good time to dive back into Anderson nostalgia. Have you got a Terror Hawks type thing you can say? Uh, 1010, Nick. 1010. 1010. 1010, sir. 1010. 1010. Must you open your mouth and reveal the vacuum of your mind? Mm -hmm. I remember. So, um, well, you see, my wife's a vegetarian, but bizarrely, she doesn't like sprouts. So I never get sprouts right. at home, and they are my favourite vegetable. But <laughs> what would you have to say to Terra Hawks fans and people? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, we rambled away through that really nicely. <laughs> should, we, <laughs> should we go on to the next thing? Yes. What's the next thing? <laughs> what? Two. One. Big, Big finish. finish. We, we love, love stories. Strange. Big, Big finish. finish. We, we love, love stories. Very strange. Uh, <laughs> we are trying to get it synchronised. <laughs> it's very difficult. Coming soon from Big Finish. Ah!